So it was a wonderful uh, journey what Dr. Virat has shared with us and uh, every aspect of mammal group he had covered as far as the understanding of the four bigger remedies which we are usually prescribing in our clinical practice uh, rest of other medic medicines which are prescribed but rarely so today uh, some of the clinical uh, practical tips which I got in my practice as well as what I understood mammal group as generals and how we have to see this mammal in our uh, clinical day to day practice. This is very important aspect of learning the group. See, we always learn every remedy by a uh, trimiasmatic process what Sir has uh, taught us in one of the method methodological process. But uh, this group is uh, like a different kind of group and we have to understand this group as certain level of core feeling of a person, not as a different uh, level of trimiasmatic process. But we have to differentiate that the sora is like this, psychosis is like this and syphilis is like this according to the rubric we have as far as. So what mammal? Now, uh, to understand mammal in general, that we have to uh, look for a, a social context and we have to look for the animal context in general and their behavioral pattern as a process. So, when we understand the behavioral pattern and the social context of a larger group of uh, kingdom that we call as a mammal, so in, from that we have to extract certain qualities of a certain mammalian uh, drugs okay so uh, what i am sharing with you is just a, a class subclass for the understanding that these are the remedies to perform our medicines and general overviews for ma uh, re uh, mammals remedies that a mammal has also a class so there are different different kind of class so from that we have to understand if this mammal is represented as this quality, this mammal is represented as this quality because every class has a different different process and uh, what they bear as a general so general overview is like that they have a certain uh, common characteristic and from that common characteristic a different different characteristic goes into different subclasses so this is what we are going to deal with today so mammal so mammal Mammals are the group of what uh, rightly said by Dr. Virat is a vertebrate. One quality is vertebrate. Second quality has <coughs> meme. And third quality that they produce a milk. A female produce a milk for the nourishment of the ear. So they are the most evolved and intelligent creatures of the animal kingdom. Rightly said by Dr. Virat. So how we have to understand that so when mammal comes into uh, evolution process so there are the evolution process that the big bang theory start from big bang theory the blast is going on then the earth crust is developed from earth crust the little part of the sea that sea the sea uh, uh, the creatures of the seas then uh, after that the, the sea creatures the creatures of the land is developed then reptilians and then after reptilians there is a vertebrates and that vertebrates goes into the mammalians and the, the highest mammalians the homo sapiens which we call as human beings are us so this is what the highest evolutions of the human being so the genetic memories that we carry from the big bang theory till today is, is something that we represent certain level of uh, qualities of the evolutionary process of the all the creatures in the development or evolutions of hum our human life. So human also share the same feelings, same uh, intelligency or a same kind of uh, defense that they have engrafted in their genetic memory from the evolutions of the human being. So then these are the most evolved intelligent creatures that why they are called as intelligent because in the before mammalian process there is a reptilians and the seas 
uh, sea, uh, sea and the animal which is living in the seas. So in that animal characteristic, there is only a difference called as survival and the fight. You know? So they have carries a certain memories that they have to survive for the sense and if there is a survival is threatened, I have to fight, I have to kill others and I have to survive for myself. So this is what the, the basic quality of that. So in that the animal quality comes into is that they have to fight, they have aggressions and they have a malice, vindictive kind of nature and they need to kill. For survival of the self, they kill their own children also, like in a uh, reptilian groups. So they uh, they engulf their child, uh, children or uh, baby snake for the survival. So this is what the mem uh, from that the animal evolution is that so this memory is animal's memory. But after the development of the vertebrates or a mammalian. There is certain things which is developed which we call as a class of morals. So that how moral come into the process it from that so sense of right and wrong comes from the mammals. Before mammals there is no sense of right and wrong is there. So when you are uh, dealing with a uh, uh, patients and which have uh, either a lack of morals or either uh, no morals or a want of moral, you can either land up into the remedy which is from the lower evolutionary animal group of remedies or earth crust remedies out of that. So for example, mercury is earth crust. So mercury is a lack, a lack of morals. There is a tarantula, spiders, there is a ophelia, they have a lack of morals. So this is what the moral comes after that. Okay. So you have to understand when the morality is at compromisations you have to go for the animal kind of group of remedy and the morality is good so even the oram, oram is also earth crust but there is a nobility is there so there is some moral so it doesn't matter that the earth crust has no moral but it is something that you have to understand for the pre, uh, from the natures so this is what they are highly evolved and uh, intelligent kind of creatures in the total animal kingdoms so we are the human beings carries all the memories which we uh, run from the evolutionary dead. So some of the genetic memory plays a certain role for the behavior pattern. So according to that behavior we have to understand this is stuck somewhere in this mammalian brain. And from that mammalian brain, see limbic system is developed and the uh, corpus uh, cerebral, cerebral is developed because of this intelligence. You know? So limbic system is something called as emotions. Before uh, uh, that re reptilian brain has no limbic system, no emotions. You know why emotions come? The emotions comes to that there is a nourishment of the young. So that they feel that I can survive properly. I need to reproduce something and I can take care of my younger ones and I have to protect them. So that is the bonding and that is the emotion that comes into the brain and that for that brain it is developed as a limbic system called as emotional brain and after that emotional brain they learn something out of emotions and they learn something logical things that for survival we have to be like this so they develop certain rules as a moral. So we have to live for certain society, we have to live, live in certain groups, we, live, we have to live in certain customs and we have to live in certain religions so that they have used their logical brain and that is the reason behind the cor uh, cortex is developing and that is what intelligence is developing. So this is what the process. So mammal has this evolution. First is a moral is developed, emotions has developed, so emotions lead to caring of and nurturing of something or either is their, their belongings or their, their children and their families and everything and when the family is gathering they develop certain norms and that norms is a certain moral so this is what evolution of mammal is are you getting me very easy to understand the process if you understand the evolutionary process then you can find the uh, exactness what the patient is representing to us in their clinical history. So we have to understand this process. So <coughs> mammal group 
is something that uh, they include the human is the highly evolved horse cat lion dolphin god elephant monkey kangaroo camel and even a bat so these are the commonest uh, uh, mammals which we are seeing so we have to understand the behavior of the certain uh, uh, mammals and from that behavior we have to understand what the same behavior is human is representing to us in our clinical practice and from that we have prescribed so this is something different kind of learning what we learn in our materia medica as a sora psychosis and syphilis but this is something what is the evolutionary learning of the human brain as well as the human behavior as well as the feelings so what is that thought feeling action and behavior so what they thought something they have the feelings and according to that feelings they have certain actions as a part of reaction and as a part of reaction they end up certain behavior so this is what the evolutionary process of understanding mammal so how they evolve they so they have a certain uh, norms certain norms because of a moral so they forms a group they forms a group they fo focus on uh, issues of the self worth i need to be worthful see every every intelligent person has certain kind of ego and that that ego is developed as they have to be at a self worth but what is happening so to to maintain the worth there is some see i am alone i cannot maintain the ego but i need a pack i need a group or something else. so i need i have to maintain certain things i need to depend on someone so there is a process of dependency but to dependency i need to show that i am a bigger one so there is a alpha wolf theory what we call as alpha wolf theory is that something that in the pack of the wolf one wolf is very very powerful they dominate others and they win and after that winning they run the whole pack okay so that is what to dominate someone they have to compete with the other male wolf okay so there is a feeling of competitiveness okay to win the competitions against the feminine the feminine is a powerful aspect of the animal kingdom but to win against the feminine they have to look a uh, wonderful they have to look a uh, very very powerful they have to look uh, attractive so this is what the the process is called as attractiveness you know so the evolutionary process and after that attractiveness after that competitions they started that they have won the pack and they are dominated now after domination they started giving that i need to take care of everyone as a pack because this is my responsibility so what they started they started nurturing them one to nurture that someone to nurture someone they have to make a hierarchy that i am a bigger one up uh, below, below that there are someone so they have given certain work below that someone they have certain given work below that there is certain work so this is that they develop hierarchy see every word, one one word is giving you understanding of the process so hierarchy is maintained so one pack is like a kabila you know the theory of kabila so kabila in kabila the person is one is the leader and they have given a task to someone else and that are the pack and that pack is behaving according to the the leader is telling so this is called the rules of hierarchy after that hierarchy they have to maintain the territory you know so kabila has a particular territory we have to live in this territory only we cannot go this beyond this this is something called as a morality you know if you do not maintain this territory i will throw you out of this territory you know so this is what what happens so if you do not maintain the territory so group has acceptance you if you maintain the territory group has acceptance to that but you cannot maintain that you need to suffer so what am everybody is jealous of that things to do my work in a efficient way and i cannot go out the territory if i will not doing like this or if someone else is doing better than me i had the feeling of being jealous you know so this is what they have feeling a jealousy jealousy where they they feel they feel jealousy in performing the task most of times okay so most of time we find that the issue is there are nijathani and there is a jealousy that 
uh, I have done all the works. So he always says lamenting, I have not been appreciated and prescribed Kalkiri as well. Because all that, I have done the work. But again, there is a part of jealousy. Even Kalkiri herself is a very jealous remedy. Our uh, Samas is a very jealous remedy. And it is a very jealous remedy. Like us, it is a very jealous remedy. But ab above that, that they have to perform perfectly. If they cannot perform in a very territorial manner or not in a hierarchical order or not in the territory, what they feel? They feel suffer because if cannot perform in a well manner the group or the leader will kick off me or throw me out of this territory so there is the dependency comes here again i am dependent on my pack and if i cannot fulfill or perform in a very manner man manner then i will be thrown out but what inside they feel they feel wrong they feel suffer this is wrong so this is what something that they so in that way our patient has two kind of mentality so this is what evolutionary process what i am maintaining in the one slide is that our patient feels a split between the animal qualities and the human qualities so that is what the one side is a human nature one side is the animal nature so what is that the human nature dependency self worth nurturing caring hierarchy Okay, but what is the animal nature? Territory, performance, jealousy, group, acceptance, not acceptance. So these are the both characteristics are there in one person. So how this can be represented to us in patients? So what uh, the what can be emerged from the comparisons center around? So this is what two comparison is going on. So what are the uh, the themes which emerge from that? See, evolutionary, I need to remain in the territory, I need to remain in the hierarchical order and I need to perform according to my master or my leader is telling to me. But what happened? So for that, they have a theme emerging that either they are dependent or independence or nurturing or lack of nurturing. See, exactly the opposite aspect of these things is a feeling of having been suffered wrong and the suppression of the natural instinct in order to harmonize with the group to which one is belonging or each mammal will express these things on its own way so these are the different different kind of mammal has to maintain this process now you say uh, you had seen dr virat has given uh, a few remedies theme that a lack can is something lack uh, defloratum is something lack felinum is something and the lysinum is something. So what lack can presentation is? Lack can presentation is something that I need to dependence. I got nurturers from my masters. I need to serve at all to the master in spite of everything is happening to me. Even my master beats me, I need to remain with them. So they suffer the self-abuse, they cannot. And from that self-abuse, they feel that every fault is of mine. I am looked down upon, I am dirty, I am feeling bad and they goes into low self worth because their worth is going down. So they goes into less and that is the reactions of that person. They condemn themselves, the lack of low self worth, they are being despised. So these are the feelings in lack canina. Whereas lack phalina is a different kind of group of the lack. What they want, they are being same situations they are serving the master, but why they are serving the master? Because they have certain self worth. You know, dog has a different worth and the cat has a different worth. So what they, they their worth is something that they are being a uh, valid family from the uh, tigress family. So they have a power, they have independency in that evolutionary phase. But what they are, when they are being domesticated, they have to compromise their power. They have to compromise their uh, process of uh, self-dependency. But again, in their genetic memory, something is going on that is they want freedom from the... Because you can put cat into uh, uh, what we call as uh, prison. But you cannot put uh, a big, big cat like a lioness or like a, a tigress. You cannot put... They are the jungle animals. So what is that? They want freedom. So the feelings of independence is they want to be independent. But to become independent they have to survive on the societies. 
to become independent they have to survive on the societies and for their survival what they do is they does that i am feeling suffer wrong i need to suppress my natural things but i am giving you something that i can be free from so that is what the theme of prostitute what is the theme of prostitute right now we have the uh, movie gangu bai you know so what gangu bai theme is the same which we have to learn that this is the remedy that she can be a lucky felina she can be this is what our understanding process what is the story behind the gangu bai she belongs to some gujarat uh, land and she got married with one person that person bring them to the mumbai and uh, she feels that my life is very okay i am so i am dependent on that person but that man was uh, something a uh, good not good moral and that man has sold her to somewhere else in a prostitute area in a very near a low price so she feels that uh, uh, their life is at survival and now she had to remain uh, in this because she had some worth in the gujarat and she cannot come back to the home what is my face someone is looking because i am being dirty so this is what the dirty feelings goes on in that from that dirty feelings they become very independent and they started uh, fighting for that and what happened in the meanwhile she got mad with some powerful persons so she find the security at some powerful persons and she met with that and that powerful persons has give a security and support and a financial support and from that financial support she evolved she evolved as an independent lady and she fought for all the prostitute are there in the uh, so this is what something that they either they suffer wrong but they fought for that and that is what that's why the remedy uh, that's why the that uh, gangubai uh, is become a leader and this is what a in independence equality of that so this is what being a prostitute from prostitute she become a leader in the prostitute area and she fought for the all the prostitute so this is what uh, some lady which is like this and this is a valid group of remedy are you getting me very easy to understand the theme there are the part of jealousy everything ek dialogue usme bola hai ki किसी ने शादी शादी में एक्सेप्ट किया नहीं और किसी ने वो कोठे पे रखा नहीं ऐसा कुछ एक डायलॉग है आई डोंट रिमेम्बर दैट डायलॉग बट दिस इज व्हाट समथिंग द वर्ल्ड इज रिप्रेजेंट समथिंग दैट देयर इंडिपेंडेंसी देयर पावर एंड देयर फीलिंग सो दिस इज व्हाट अ मैमल ग्रुप इज व्हाई व्हाई दिस हैपन दिस हैपन बिकॉज़ ऑफ दे वांट टू हार्मोनाइज एवरीथिंग इन द ग्रुप्स हार्मोनाइज एवरीथिंग इन द सोसाइटी हार्मोनाइज एवरीथिंग इनटू द देयर टेरिटरीज so territory can be anything it is a state it is a society it is a group it is the organization or it is anything which they have domain okay so these are the territory so when uh, when you find the territory issue what are the most commonest uh, conflict is happening there is either a territorial fear and a territorial anger so when there is a territorial fear most of suffer from the lung complaint and when it when there is a territorial anger they suffer from the urinary tract infection so most of time they suffer from this urinary and the sexual organ of female genitals so all the remedy has the actions on female genitals all the remedy has actions on a memory gland why memory gland they suffer from the memory gland or a lactational period or a menstrual troubles you know when we understand the conflict from the gnm perspective so that is what the conflict of nurturing and lack of nurturing you know so what is nurturing i giving uh, my pet a, a nurturing so that is called the nest worry conflicts or a conflict of called as caring or loving so due to that nest worry conflict and nurturing they suffer from breast affections you know what is that nurturing prolecting prolecting gives you nurturing so most of time the uh, what lack defloor lack can lack defloratum is the remedy for that the internally produce the milk because it stimulate the prolactin centers you know so that is what we have to understand the conflict that the conflict regarding nest worry nest worry means the conflict of the nest nest is a home worry means anxiety so home or territory or the house or the family or that kabila which we called as a hierarchical order 
and that worry can lead to the development of the breast process are you getting me so we are correlating the mammals with the conflict as well as the understanding so they express all this in own way so i am giving you own way the different kind of way of the process now what the lac defloratum process so lac defloratum is same like lac caninum and most of time what lac defloratum suffer from lac defloratum suffer from two uh, commonest symptom which we found in alenski note where one is a headache and second word is a constipation you know now what is that two conflict is like this you know so when we uh, considering the conflict aspect and the pathological aspect with their uh, evolutionary understanding of the psyche that most of time the deck defloratum is being dominated by others so dominated by others that there is some uh, super order on that and that person is always giving them order and everything so most of time they suffer from the problem with the head of the family or problem with the head person or some superior person so they might suffer from and what they do they have to suppress their feelings so when you find suppress feelings suppress anger or suppress sexual desire you can have a migraine so are you getting me what is the conflict we are dealing with why lack like lack like defloratum is the remedy is like this they have to suffer they have to suffer wrong they have been being dominated by others they are being abused in spite of being abused they have to suffer they have to take care of they have to nurture the same ones so this is what they suffer from headache and if every kind of the headache symptoms you can find in allen's medical medical that american sick headache there is a forehead to occipital uh, there is a alternating side headache there is a nausea vomiting and everything okay and again what is that the strong characteristic of lac defloratum is aversion to milk why there is aversion to milk if i use my milk for myself i cannot nurture others so that is what i have a strong feeling that i cannot use my milk for myself same way that what we are dealing with what virata says that all the cows milk is for cows children but this is not for cow children this is for the human being the same expression that we find in that human being so when you find a migraine with the strong ruminating history with a strong aversion to milk along with one thing is called as constipation so migraine alternate with constipation or migraine with constipation you can think of lac defloratum very wonderful remedy which we prescribe frequently in our clinical practice for the migraine so what kind of constipation now constipation my constipation happen in the into this you know every person has a feelings that i need to dispose the dirt out of my process so that what uh, the, the dirtiness comes out of this <coughs> and that dirtiness is something that i need to throw it out but what they are they are dealing with the process that they have to they can not or they cannot throw out that dirt why because due to strong dominations and due to not developing their own identity now here the uh, conflict is of uh, rectum belongs to the conflict of identity conflict of identity means i have to be dependent i have my own decisions i need to take the decisions for the others and this is what they have to create their identity but in that mammal they never never develop their own identity because they need to serve others they need to be dominated by others and due to that process they never develop their identity so this is rela related to the identity conflicts and from that identity conflicts they suffer from the motor aspect of the rectum is not working properly and due to that there is a constipation are you getting me and why they cannot perform properly so that why they cannot perform properly they are being given lots of enema and that enema relieves you know so this is what when you find a headache when you find strong dominations when you find aversion to milk when you find constipations and when you find that constipations is relieved by enema 
you can directly prescribe let doctor try are you getting me this is what a wonderful understanding of the process now the another way of expressions of the male is o1 way that is what uh, lysinum what is the lysinum represent to us again lysinum in the soric state was a very dependent like a leg can i know but what happens that the threshold level of uh, uh, tolerance is de, uh, is being crossed and when the threshold is crossed they feel they are being tormented they are being harassed they are being abused and they are being tortured by the masters or by the someone that is living in the society or living in the uh, uh, tax or living in the families or something so what they the reactions the initial reactions was suppressing 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 till they can but at one point their expression goes into outburst of the anger and that outburst of the anger leading to the rage fury violence and that violence goes into the two way one is injuring self and one is injuring others you know why because the once the lysin goes into autoimmune process that they suffer from wrong they wrong suffer they are being despised they are being uh, forsaken deserted they are being tormented they are being tortured in after that they goes into feelings that they have tremendous anger and they started showing anger towards family but after that anger they feels that i have done this again wrong and that is what the trick repentance it is a soric autoimmune process sorosophilitic anger rage violence with the quick repentance sorosophilitic and after that sorosophilitic process they have tremendous tormented feeling in the mind that feelings goes into physical violence and that physical violence goes into cutting the cell injuring the cell harming the cell and this lead to the autoimmune process in the lysinum so in that case again very very important aspect of lysinum is there is a sensitivity to the, all the senses what dr virat has rightly said they can not endure the nature's process the dazzling light sensitive to sensitive to flowing water sensitive to water sensitive to noise these are the sensitivity can provoke the violences and that violence is may can and again the lysin can go into another aspect called as necrotic behaviors or a disturbing disturbing others so they they stab someone else or they desire to kill someone else these are the feelings of a mammalian so each mammal express this in the different different aspect are you getting me easy to understand the mammal so all this uh, dr virat has given wonderful in the session that need to belong to a group issue of hierarchy a strong maternal instinct and other common issues what are the strong maternal instinct to understand the maternal instinct we need to understand the milk and what is the milk so milk provide everything to the baby what dr virat has said that milk provide everything either amino acid carbohydrate proteins antibodies and everything that is needed for the growth of the child and until pediatrician always says until 6 months of age you must have to give breastfeed only to the child so this is what that bond has created a strong relationship with the children now what is that when when, uh, when you have to understand the reflex called as uh, milk reflex so in the milk reflex what happened when the baby started uh, sucking the nipple of the mother the the sensitized point of the neurotoms of the nipple is stimulating the brain specifically it stimulate the hypothalamus and after that stimulating hypothalamus is stimulate the posterior pituitaries and in the posterior pituitaries it releases something called as prolactins you know somatotrop it the hypothalamus releases the somatotrop and the somatotrop stimulate the posterior pituitary and posterior pituitary releases the prolactin so when the prolactin is flowing from the pituitary it goes into blood circulation after getting circulation into blood it directly stimulate the breast ducts and from the duct it started secreting the milk it started secreting the 
milk and it produce milk gob so that was that milk is a uh, produce that it is and the oxytocin so what is that uh, again again at that time prolactin and oxytocin both are released now what is oxytocin role oxytocin has to pump contractions the role of oxytocin is contractions and relaxation contraction and relaxation it can relaxes the uh, uterine or muscles also or it can relaxes the the elastin fibers of the breast duct so what is that that duct can compress and being relaxed compression so at that time milk is flowing or ejected from the duct are you getting me so this oxytocin and prolactin both hormones are for the nurturance so this nurturing is producing strong bond between the mother and the child so that is what the basic strong maternal instinct of every mother now what are the conflict start is uh, dr virat has rightly said the conflict start when this bond is not being maintained or this bond is not being properly taken care of or this bond is being affected why affected because mother has the feeling during pregnancy that this pregnancy is unwanted this pregnancy is because of so much so abuse this pregnancy is because of the rape this pregnancy is because of a uh, sinful act what she had done out of the social norms so due to that dirty feeling in the mind they never develop their breast ductules and this can suppress the prolactin and oxytocin so they have a lack of milk and this lack of milk producing the child of lack remedies are you getting me how sora is compromised so strong maternal instinct so everything is like this so i am i am going a little bit faster into this so what are the patient expectations they are belong to the herd they are belong to the community society social animals included excluded expelled safe in the group so how they represent us into our chemical practice that uh, uh, sir humne shaadi ki hai shaadi to ki hai mere papa mummy ne shaadi kara di shaadi ke baad itna sara problem chal raha hai अब ऐसी हालत हो गई है ना तो मैं मेरा ससुराल छोड़ के जा सकती हूँ ना मैं मायके में नहीं जा सकती क्योंकि अगर मायके में जाऊंगी तो उनकी इज्जत का क्या होगा और ससुराल में इतनी परेशानी है जिसकी वजह से मैं छोड़ नहीं सकती और ऐसी हालत है जैसे मेरे को जैसे मैं शादी करके आई तो शुरू शुरू में बहुत अच्छा था पर शादी के बाद ऐसा हुआ कि जैसे मुझे एक काम वाले की तरह ट्रीट किया जाता है जैसे मुझे एक घर की नौकरानी की तरह ट्रीट किया जाता है जैसे मुझे ऐसे ट्रीट किया जाता है जैसे कोई लात मार के किसी को बाहर नहीं फेंक देता है वैसे ट्रीट किया जाता है और कैसा है सर हमारा एक बंगला है हम लोग गाँव में रहते तो बड़ा बंगला है दीरानी जिठानी है तो सबके बड़े बड़े रूम है अब मेरी जब शादी हुई तो हमको एक छोटा सा कमरा दे दिया आठ फीट का कमरा जो वॉचमैन रहता था ना हमारे बंगले में वही कमरे में हम आज रहते हैं कॉमन अगेन वॉट वॉट दे फील दे फील झील जिठानी को बड़ा वाला रूम दिया है उनको वो दिया है मुझे ये नहीं दिया है and that is what they are being treated by this agar main kuch bolna chahu to mere sasur bol dete tum ghar se nikal diye jayenge ya tumko alag rehna abhi mujhe alag jana nahi hai par aisi paristhiti upasthit ho rahi hai to main kya karu aur wahi problem se mujhe sir ye migraine stress vagera rehta hai and that is what the patient expressions is going on so are you getting me what the the commonest things that they represent they need to be in a community they need to be in a society they need to be in a pair they want care nurture again there is a jealousy towards someone and again that there is a fear of them being excluded or included and that is what they are safe because they want that i need to remain in the house only okay so if you hierarchy so in the hierarchy there is a problem five for the dominant positions for example leader manager head of the family being mother in law especially in the etc they have an intense desire to be superior to maintain the dominant position by not allowing anyone to boss over them so this is again the characteristic of family group so in family group in canidy group in canidy group we have a wolves we have a uh, dog we have a license 
and we have experimentum canine. So remedy is like this. But in a pretty group, we have a tigress, we have a cat. <coughs> so mostly the uh, leolinum, lack leolinum. So they want to be superior. They want to be dominated by, they can't be dominated by others. They want to dominate the things. So this is what they need to be uh, supreme of in the hierarchy of other group. So most of the time, I have to do that. 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 If we have to do that, then we have to do that. So when we think of the orthodox family, so when we think of the orthodox family and the very quarrelsome and angry family and dominating dictator, we have a little bit of remedy like lycopodium, lacasis, we have a Kali group. So Kali group has orthodoxy and domination. So out of this, we have to understand the mammal is also the same. Okay? So this is what the theme of being supreme and again, if superior is not superior, then inferior is So always, they always compare that if you think about it, if you don't listen to 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 it, we will not listen to it, we will have to do that, we will not listen to it, 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 we will say that if you don't do this, you don't keep it in the land, then you will leave the city from the city. Now what do we do sir? We have to live, but we are doing this. So this is what something that superiority, problem with the superior and inferior. So, for that they have a commonest feeling that they are being looked down, they are being despised, they are being contempt by others, or they have been uh, diminished, or they have been short. So this is what something that they are of a low rank and the problem with the inferiority. Again, I have said the same things uh, as strong maternal instinct, what I have mentioned earlier. So for maternal instinct, they have a motherly love, warmth, nurturing and anxiety about children. So when you find these things, you have a certain group of remedy like muriaticums. All the muriaticums are the mothering feelings or the caring and nurturing. They want to be in the relationship. They try to make the babies the comforts and everything. They are giving a warmth, love, care. But here a different kind of things is they have a strong bond with the child. You know, so we have a remedy that clinging to mothers, but clinging to mothers, no lack remedy are give, given clinging to mothers. Even though they are. Because in one kind of lack remedy, which we call as marsupials. So there are different kind of uh, lack remedy. One is egg laying mammal, another is a pouch bearing mammal, and third one is a memory gland mammal. You know, so the egg laying mammals are a different pouch bearing mammals. So pouch bearing mammals that in that we have a kangaroo. So in a kangaroo, the feeling is that the uh, the child is born, but it is immature. It is totally dependent and it can mature in that pouch after birth. So that is something that they cling to mother for a certain time of period after birth. So this is again when you find Baraita, Silica or Pulsatila uh, clinging to mother, you can think of uh, mammal remedy like kangaroo. Something that they are clinging to mother, they are totally dependent. So there is one rubric that helplessness like an infant. In that the lack remedies are there. So this is what something we have to understand. So this is what a mother wants, cares, nurturing and this. Other that there is a issue related to lactations and menses. Everybody is known that why I have mentioned that is because of the conflict associated with that. Uh, issue related to breast because the conflict of next worry. Symptom related to the ovary and hormonal disturbances. Already I had mentioned that playfulness, fear of snake. The most common persecutions is that the fear of snake in all leg remedy are that there is a fear. That fear goes into imaginations and that imagination goes into a altered perceptions. That perception that they find everywhere the snakes are. Because snake is something that they are going to pursue, they are going to bite, they are going to kill, they are going to attack. So most of the time, this is the persecution's feelings in the lack remedy. And most of the lack remedy suffer from the headache. I already mentioned why they suffer from the headache, because there is a problem with the domination. So these are the commonest features 
the we have to understand uh, this in a very uh, fast manner because every mammal is a class, subclass, order, suborder, superfamily, family, and subfamily. So I go a little bit faster in this. So we have a three class of mammal, which is one is egg laying, pouch bearing, and placentals. Okay. So all we are, all we are as a human being are the placentals placenta. because our placenta. We have one remedy called placentrex or placenta. So placenta is bearing the same features like leg remedies you know because the theme is like this placenta is like a nutrition okay so we have a subclass brocheria the name do not need to remember it is a egg, egg laying marsupials so marsupials are the pouch bearing in which kangaroo koala and opossums so let macropus is the one of the remedy it is from kangaroo not available in india i don't think so or I had uh, written that uh, certain yellow uh, uh, remedies name which are abundantly available, available in our uh, areas. So subclass Eucheria, this Eucheria is all written and there are the different 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 class of uh, Articula, Cetaceae, Carnivora, so, no need to remember these names because this is not going to help you in any practice but you have to understand just the basic aspect of that things. So uh, in order there is certain family. So family has a very uh, nouns. So we have a bovidae family. In bovidae family we have a cow. Camelidae family we have a camel. Cervidae family we have a deer. Giraffidae family has a giraffe. Hippopotamus and Swede. Swede is being called as a pig. So these are the commonest one uh, one order. Okay. So uh, what are the remedy from the bovidae family? In bovidae family we have a goat. So goat has the remedy derived from the goat is lac caprina. And the mountain goat, another goat which is lived in mountain which is stronger than the goat, the lac rupee caprinum. These are the remedy available in market. Another is a sheep. So the sheep is something that is a lac ovis. So ovis is also there is a, there is a cow. Cow is remedy is called as lac defloratum. Uh, there is a felt ovary, ox gall bladder. Again, this is not prepared from the lac, but this is prepared from the mammal. So it was included in that. You know, lysinum is not the leg remedy. Lysinum is the <coughs> sarcos, which we call as a secretions, disease secretions, nosos, which we call as no, not sarcos, disease secretions. A felt ovary is a sarcos secretion. So that is what something it is prepared from the mammal. So we have to understand this. There is a remedy which we call as from prepared from the buffalo, American buffalo. It is called lac bisonis or bisonis bisonis. This is the remedy. So these are the remedy available. Uh, Camelidae family, we have a lac camelinum domomadri. It is also there. There is a lac <coughs> lama. Lama is something like it is something like uh, you can find that is a combination of a uh, horse and camel. A little bit a different kind of. It is not like a, a huge like a camel and it is not short like a horse. But it is something a uh, something in between. So it is a lac lama. Uh, lac lama is the remedy. Cervidae family, we have a deer, musk deer. From musk deer, this secretion, we have a moscus. Dipples oil, we have from dipples oil, so oleum animalis. And giraffidae family, there is hippopotamus and giraffe. Uh, pig, so we have a lac suis, uh, the pig remedy. So, uh, cetaceae order, so in cetaceae order, there is the whales. So, from blue whales, we have this remedy, uh, Balanopatra musculus. This remedy is available, but I had not seen any patients or sperm well. So from sperm well, we have a remedy called as Amra Gracia. So we always, so what is that? Lack has feeling of dirty. Now you correlate, Amra Gracia is also feeling of dirty. What is the reaction? I cannot open up. So Amra Gracia is a reaction of being embarrassment, close. So what is that? They don't have to go to the washroom. The feeling is that if I do washroom, this it makes dirty. So that there is a stranger feeling of stranger and somebody is present, they cannot pass within the presence of others. So this is what a dirty feeling is in. So again it, again it comes from the leg. Okay. So dolphin, so dolphin is a leg, dolphinum is the remedy and uh, delphis, delphius is amaz amazing amazon river dolphins. Okay. These are the remedies available. Carnivora, so one is called as another group. We have a bovides and camelides and everything. This is the something called as 
another class is the carnivora class has a canidae pinnipedia and felliformia so in caniformia we have a canidae group in felliformia we have felidae group so these are the sub order so actually canidae we have a uh, uh, mephitidae mustelidae and ursidae and canidae so what canidae family has so canidae family has a dog that can lycinum lacupinum means wolf red fox sanguinus vulpus 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 okay this is a fox palmo vulpus a lungs of the fox so these are the remedy which is available in medremedy uh, mustelidae family we have a skunk so from skunk we have mephitis mephitis you know the another group of but get the melis melis basger it's again a small uh, mammal and raccoon so from raccoons we have a token blotters these are the remedy which we uh, from this group ursidae family from ursidae family we have brown bear ursus arctus lac ursinum grizzly bear so you have to go through the uh, google you have to find that words and you have to see the animals so from that animals you can understand what kind of animals it is polar bear ursus giant panda so these are the remedies in madreya medica so i am going a little bit faster why because this name is just for the understanding california in california we have a felidae hyena and herpistidae so hyena you know oh very very they they uh, do uh, what we call as they hunt the any animal in the groups in the pack hyena always hunt in the pack not always singly while the share always hunt for singly you know but and hyena has the capacity that they are very very foxy in nature they make a trap so certain kind of person who goes into trap you can think of hyena you know so we have uh, the felidae family the remedy is tigra tiger panthera tigris lion lac leonidum jaguar panthera onca leopard panthera pardus cheetah puma ocelot cat and the cat remedy is called as lac leonidum so we have to remember this only because these are the remedy which is less proven and these are the remedy which is in the research level right now so we have less number of the cases out of that and we have to understand this remedy in a very deeper sense okay a uh, hyena so in hyena there are different different hyena and her this study there is a mongoose african market suricata suricata so this is what suris as this is also a remedy as in uh, metal america but i did, i didn't have any data about this so mouse in a mouse it is uh, myotis myotis another order is zerenthia there are the less number of the remedy insectivora in insectivora there is a mole and hedgehog you know hedgehog you have seen hedgehog the animal which have a, uh, what we called as a, the fur and the fur is like a sting तो काटा वाला है, तो क्या बोलते हैं? साउंड पाइन, विच वी कॉल्ड इस पॉर्टियो 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 uh donkey from donkey we have a lac asinum from horse we have a lac equinum from the horse rudimentary thumbnail we have a castor equinum then equilibrium of the amniotic fluid hippomance and horse urine we have a urinum equinum so this are the remedy which is there in our uh castor equinum you know rudimentary thumbnail of so this is the remedy for the crack nipples now what is the uh, role of this you know mammal has the connection with the nipple mammal has the connection with the breast so castor equinum from the horse and what is that this nipple is not no more needed so syphilis is going to happen at that level and from that level i have to cut off this thing so this is what they develop crack nipples we have to understand this 
very easy because mammal has the connection with the mammary gland. So lac remedy, lac uh, castoripinum is the remedy which is for the crack nipple. Very easy to remember. Okay. Primates we have a monkey. So from from monkey we have a lac rhesus and human milk we have a lac humanum and lac maternum. These are the same. They bear the same characteristic of the process. I had prescribed lac humanum to one case of uh, a girl who suffered from uh, vitiligo. So what happened in vitiligo? So the girl, seven years old girl, came to me with a complaint of vitiligo, especially around the uh, uh, between the uh, vagina and uh, the anus. So around that perianal part, there is one spot of uh, vitiligo and that suggests that now vitiligo we have to understand the vitiligo is suggestions that they are the things that they want to suppress or they have to uh, what we call as they are being abused sexually and they want a brutal separation to someone else that is what the conflict of vitiligo what is the conflict of vitiligo brutal separations so brutal separations means i need to separate brutally with someone else or I am being brutally separated by someone. So two things can create vitiligo. Now this vitiligo in that. So out of that, uh, all the history I got that the mother instinct is something that mother has suppressed all anger, 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 and mother can never express everything to that child. And mother is taking care of the child and everything during pregnancy. But uh, they are being suppressed. So the expression of suppression is, which is found in the children is that the child born with the left handedness and the mother father and the in-laws are trying to convert that child into the right handedness. So they always dominate them, dominate them and ask the children, uh, daughter that you have to write with the right handed and they convert it. <coughs> so this is what from that rubric I got uh, inclination to suppression of the natural inclinations and I prescribed stephysegria because in the whole pregnancy the mother is being abused and mother has suppressed anger. So after prescription of stephysegria I didn't get anything result within 3-4 months. But what happened uh, again I re repertorized with the same rubric from the complete repertory and from the complete repertory I found only one remedy that is lac humanum. So lac humanum I had prescribed on the basis of the rubric uh, suppression of natural inclination left hand to the right hand and on the basis of that I prescribed lac humanum 200 single dose and to my surprise this was my experiment only because I didn't get from the stephys agria that's why I started that I was thinking out of box and that was my experience so I prescribed lac humanum to that girl and to my surprise within one month the uh, father has sent me the photo on my whatsapp that the patch is going to decrease and within three months all patch gone so what is the lack humanum feelings same like sepsigria they are being suppressed because all lack has been dopinated and they want to maintain the harmonies so what mother has mother wanted sexual separations they are being suppressed so what child feels mama don't worry I am I am making something in my body as a disease that I am brutally separated to the sexual aspect. So they develop vitiligo at particular sexual part. Are you getting me? So that is what lac humanum is something that they want harmony with everyone. So their sora is something that they have to maintain the harmony with the everyone. They are being very very what we call as uh, Mother Teresa, so Mother Teresa, so they are being Manavtavad, I mean, everyone has to live with them, everyone has to keep them together, and they are very humanitarian work, so they want this, so humanitarian and homeostasis is the key theme of lack humanity. So I found that and I got the wonderful reason, I will show that photograph, if I will show in my laptop. Uh, so this is what I have described an experience of lac humanum. Okay. <coughs> so these are the uh, another uh, proboscidea. So in proboscidea we have a lac loxodenta africana. This is the remedy prepared from elephant milk. And uh, another remedy is uh, lox A. Loxodenta africana 
is the ivory of the African element, means white happy. You know? Rodentia, out of Rodentia we have a beaver, uh, day mouse, mouse and red. From red we have a rectus rectus and from a common red we have a rectus norvegicus. So these are the different kind of remedies. Now we have to understand overview. How every lab represent to you in a particular aspect. What are the particular aspects that we are dealing with? That we have seen the class, subclass, family and everything. So we have seen different, different type of members. But we have to subclass into uh, another category uh, with their behavioral pattern. So what are the behavioral pattern? So an overview to mammal subgroup is uh, something like this. So we have to understand the mammal is grouped into three process. One is being domesticated. So when the domesticated, what happens? Their wildness is being gone and they need to live for the survival, so they become domesticated. Another being a prey, so they are being a, a prey by some predators, so their quality is different, and another being a predatory member, so they want to hunt for something, so these are the prey. So we have grouped these into three, and there are certain family which are there in certain, certain group. So in domesticated, there are bovidae family, horse family, deer family, so these are the family comes into this. So in predator we have a leonine uh, family family. Okay. So we have to understand that these things. So in specific group we have a marsupials, wawidi, gamidi, cervidi, canidi, muscularidae, versidae, felidae, and primates and rodents. So these are the groups we have as far as seen. Why I am going a little bit faster because you do, do not need to remember these things. That's why. But we have a domestic mammal. So what are the characteristic of domestic mammal? So all domestic mammal were in the past, in the evolution, they are wild. But why they become domesticated? Because they sacrifice their freedom and their independency to better food and safety. You know, pehle food ke liye hunt karne jana padta tha. Abhi food directly mil raha hai, to my hunting process I need to forget. So that is what their wildness gone down. So when the wildness gone down, what is the characteristic? They become mild, docile, submissive, they are dependent on others, they are being dominated by others. So they learn the domestic environment. Why they learn? The, they like the home, comfort, food and security. So their basic need is comfort, security and home. Are you getting me? So in patient what they express? They express how patient is express of domestic. So they like family environment, they like homely environment, they like cooking, they like housework, they like cleaning, they are taking care of children, they like partners and they have to be fed everyone. Okay? Or they like routine or casual work. So we always said routine or casual kali ka barataka. But this is something we have to think beyond out of box understanding. So they like or dislike relatives or gathering. So there are something that some relatives they like, some relatives they didn't like, okay. So most of time when you find uh, commonest social norms, so in social norms you find certain kind of situations. So they like or dislike relatives, gathering, gossip, ceremonies and festivals. So they have these communities and everything, festivals and that. These are, <coughs> they live in a familiar environment and don't like disturbances. They may have to be uh, with the problem with the change. Especially food or a sleeping pattern, for example, they might enjoy traveling and meeting other people, but at the same time, they might miss their home also. So what uh, Dr. Virata said, they like to travel, wonder, desire to, especially in family family, because they are wild, they are not dependent on others, and they are going out for hunting, you know? But the, the domestic animal, what the, what, what the uh, lack like deploratum, you, you know see, you see cow, so what the cow feeling is, they wonder, they go for the food outside their uh, kettles and at the end of evening or at the end of day, the cattle can come back to their homes. Why? Because they feel secure at home. So these are the domestic mammal qualities. So what are the expression of the patient? The patient wants home, homely environment, homesickness. They want cleaning at home, taking care of others at home. They are dependent on others. They sacrifice for others. 
so this is the typical feelings of mothers they wants relationship and friendship they they like daily routine chores and routine work they like gathering they like festivals they wants warm and cozy environment and this is the basic feelings of domestic members you know why they suffer this environment make them suffer because overwork make them suffer over domination make them suffer she is taking care of everyone but nobody take care of her feeling isolation feeling alone feeling neglected feeling forsaken you know so this environment make them suffer now what are the prey mammals so prey mammals prey mammals are usually for food for the predators most of that so predator will kill them and they eat them so most of prey mammals are, are herbivores they like to eat a uh, herbs or a plant you know and the uh, predator was something called is carnivores they eat the meat for the animals so this is what the th process so most of time all like remedy they like green greeneries green colors green vegetables and green foods and green juices these are the characteristic of prey mammals they like green 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 so you know domestic mammal also like green 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 because they fed on green because they fed on green uh, foods like plants plant based foods they like green environments so most of green color is associated with the mammals so they are step below the predators in the food chain so they are much weaker in the predator so when the someone is weaker what are the expression of that i have weaker so i have extreme fears fear from danger attack being tortured being dominated being killed or being overpowered by someone so these are the fears so they are very very fearful remedy rectus norvegicus or rectus rectus you know chua ko kaise dar lagta hai billi se to kya karega you all know the cartoon series tom and jerry so in that it is a different kind of story चूहा हायोसाइमस है जो बिल्ली की उंगली करता है दैट इज समथिंग टॉम एंड जेरी बट द फीलिंग दैट द इन ऑर्डर ऑफ हायरार्की ऑफ द एनिमल किंगडम और फूड चेन दे आर एट द लोअर एंड सो द फीलिंग दैट दे आर फियर पैनिक वीकर ओवर फाइवर अदर्स दे नीड टू सबमिट देमसेल्व्स और दे आर सबमिसिव वीक विल dominated not strong enough not powerful mostly pursued by others animal fight flight reaction fight and flight reaction so always they want to escape always they want to escape being attacked danger lurking killed every time and need security protection and safety so these are the characteristic of prey mammals okay in the prey mammals there are the large mammals and smaller mammals so there are different kind of prey mammals some are the large in body part and some are the small in body part so large mammal is something that they are elephant rhinoceros horses a horses apes giraffes cow buffalo and wolf and uh, whales and dolphin these are the animals which are being preyed by others you know so for that what they have they have physical strength still they have lot of physical strength but still they become prey to the predators and the patient expression that on that they have on one hand, one hand capacity self assurance self confidence but on the other they are submissive and dependent so they have a strength they have a power but on the other hand they submit themselves so this is what will strong but they need support security and they need to submit to others even though they have capacity and strength they give up rather than they fight and they like to choose non aggressive way to live the life with less confrontation so most of time kuch jhagda na ho jaye waisa chahti hu main bhale wo jo bole waisa main kar dunga aisa nahi hai ki main kar nahi sakti kar to sakte hain hum par mujhe aisa chahiye ki mujhe ghar mein family mein jhagda nahi chahiye mujhe bahar nahi jana hai mujhe yahan se nikalna nahi hai usko bhi nahi nikalna hai mujhe bhi nahi jana so that is what this is the domestic prey mammals okay these are the expressions so they wants non aggressive way to live the life और क्या होता है जब लैक डेफ्लोरेटोम में एक स्टेज हो जाता है ऐसा कि मैंने इतना सारा किया सब किया उसके बाद भी मैं अगर ये उनको इकट्ठा नहीं रख सकती हूँ या उनको मैं संभाल नहीं सकती हूँ या नर्चर नहीं कर सकती हूँ तो दे गोज इनटू टू ऑटो इम्यून प्रोसेस एंड दैट ऑटो इम्यून प्रोसेस इज दैट दे ऑलवेज मेडिटेट 
to do suicide in a very easiest manner these are the rubric which usually my mentor dr jitesh sir uses in the patient so patient always say sir ab sab kuch kar diya abhi aisa kar do aisi koi dawai de do ki wo dawai se main duniya chhod ke chali jaau itna easy kar do ki main mar jaau to ye sab kissa khatam ho jayega mujhe kisi se jhagda nahi karna hai kisi se fight nahi karni hai kisi se kisi ko kuch bolna nahi kisi ka koi dosh nahi hai sab mera hi hai to self contempt self torment and easiest way to meditate on the days of suicide so this is the leg defloratum is like this this is the prememus you know they goes into autoimmune process finally because they are always dominated by others <coughs> they like to have the company it gives them a uh, more strength but if there is nobody to support them they don't get energy and they give up completely the presence of other is enough to reassure but they are not totally dependent on Then. Again, a smaller prey mammals. What are the different aspect of smaller prey mammals? We have seen the larger prey mammals is like they have a strength, and they are very very uh, docile kind of, and they submit themselves. Okay, but what is the smaller mammals? So smaller mammals like a rabbit, rodent, deer, opossum, hedgehog, moles, these uh, monkeys, they have a less assurance. Okay, self less self assurance, and they have much less confidence. So even a slightest threat. can make a big turmoil so they goes into state of panic so most of time fear overpowering we have stramonium so again we have let us norwegicus lack like oryctologus you know you see the uh, what we call as <coughs> rabbit what we call as rabbit you know i forget the name <laughs> rabbit <laughs> so rabbit has a fear that someone is going to prey him so what they go they go fast and they goes into burrows you know to save their life so this is something that they goes into state of panic reaction so in panic reaction they have a threat to the environment and they goes into panic state so they seek safety and protection and desire to run and hide so most of them has kept desire to like stand there okay so they are totally dependent on someone to protect them and give them a safe environment to be without a safe environment means that for then so agar nahi hai so most of time they cling to someone else they give support and strength you know so what is that we thought of like parataka we thought of like yes, clinging remedy like endium tart we thought of clinging remedy like borax because totally dependent on you know borax is from the natrum group and natrum group has a row and column feeling so same as borax has a feeling of falling and they want to uh, hold and be carried so same way this prey animals has also like the same feelings okay so they want to supports and protection from the nothing from their own because of this extreme weak will and fragility this remedy are very useful in the psychotic disorders like phobia bipolar disorders and panic attacks so most of psychotic disorders phobia bipolar and mania they are being treated with this remedies the prey animals so what are the expression of the prey animals so there are different different way what we have seen one is uh, strength wala one is without strength so there are the expression is like weak weaker overpowered by others submissive weak will dominated not strong enough not powerful need support need safety and security desire protections like company desire to run away these are the something that i go away yahan protection chahiye yahan se bhag jana hai fight and flight reactions pursued attack kill so these are the small prey panic if fear fright need helping hands and companionship or friendship agar koi sath mein hai group hai to ho jayega akele karna hai to halat kharab ho jayega so that is what they want companionship they want friendship you know predatory mammal so this are the last slide we are going with and we end up our sessions as uh, just a general highlight of the mammals we are not going into much detail of everything you go through the uh, remedy details with and uh, you can understand the general highlight with the detail okay so in a predatory mammals what are the process that the predatory mammals are mostly carnivores in a prey mammals they are herbivores these are the carnivores so in a, a food chain the, this this mammals are little bit higher than the herbivores okay so what is that when the someone is higher than someone else and there is something a strength called as power there is a strength 
एंड दे ओवर पावर द प्रे सो नीचे के ऑर्डर को ओवर पावर करेंगे क्योंकि ये ऑर्डर आए हैं ओके इन द पेशेंट दे आर एक्सप्रेस बींग पावरफुल हैविंग अ स्ट्रेंथ एंड अ कॉन्फिडेंस एंड दे आर वेरी एग्रेसिव एक्सट्रीमली कॉम्पिटिटिव एंड ट्राई टू ओवर पावर अदर्स दे ट्राई टू बी फर्स्ट एंड अब ऑल ट्राई टू इम्पोज ऑन अदर्स बाय हंटिंग चेजिंग एटेकिंग एंड किलिंग दे हैव अ ह्यूज ईगो सो वेन देर इज अ पावर अल्टीमेटली ईगो कम्स इन टू यू नो नाउ वी हैव टू अंडरस्टैंड सर्टन रेमेडी टू विद द ईगो so there are some egoistic remedy like oram mat very very egoistic remedy platina very very all metals having ego okay so the egoic egoistic remedy with the mammalian feelings like if you find mammal plus oram like a personality you can think of the lac leonina okay this is a clinical tips uh, i had i had uh, seen this in the massimo's lecture on the milk remedy massimo has worked uh, wonderfully in the milk remedies and he has given every detail of the milk remedy and he has 6 to 7 years follow of each milk remedies prescribed in the clinical practice of 15 16 years so we had seen this in massimo's lectures at mumbai uh, so in that we have seen that when you find uh, oram kind of personality with the mammalian feelings so you can think of lac leonina when you find fear of being pointed instrument and very mild submissive timid and having a feeling of silicia like a silicia but the mammalian feeling you can think of lac leonina when you find a relationship maintain bondings and everything care nurturing like natremure plus mammalian feeling you can think of lac defloratum so these are the some of the clinical uh, things which have we have so you have prescribed natrum you didn't get the result but you find that this is something a mammalian remedy and you can think of this is lac defloratum you can prescribe and you can get the result so this is what we have seen so the predatory quality are more pronounced in the larger predator than the smaller so what are that the phallids most of phallids are the top most in the food chains so that they are they are more egoistic they are leader and have extreme high level of confidence and self care <coughs> while can canids canids are in the lower range so dog so dogs are smaller in their need of hunt okay in the pack so they have a low esteem whereas phallid has a high esteem so most of when you find the esteem remedy so esteem has a two way Uh, i had i had given in the uh, need of esteem the component of the positive esteem and the negative part of the esteem so in the negative part there we have a low self esteem and in the positive part we have a high esteem so in a low self esteem we have uh, dog remedy canine remedy like lac can so what is the low self esteem feeling of dog look down upon i am being despised i am being isolated i am not being cared for so these are the feelings i am being scorned i am being despised these are the feeling of low self esteem why what are the high self esteem i am a haughty i am a pride i am egoistic i condemn to others i can kill others i am uh, contemning others so these are the pride so these are the failed kind of remedies they are leadership of so or uh, they have a less self insurance in the ferrets another example is mustard which includes the visual source or the example here the first reaction is a flea rather than the fight so there are few uh, predators that they don't fight they flee away so this is what uh, felidy has one delusion that life is a game delusion life is a game like felinum is the only one remedy another delusion like felinum is it delusion cannot escape from यहां से मैं निकल सकती नहीं हूं दिस इज अलिनम इज द रेमेडी एंड लैक फेलिनम फीलिंग इज समथिंग लाइक दैट आई एम बीइंग एब्यूज बट सो मच सो एब्यूज इन एवरी सिचुएशन बट स्टिल आई नीड टू बी अ फ्रीडम सो आई नीड टू बी अ लाइक दैट आई नीड टू टेक केयर ऑफ माई सिक्योरिटी एंड सेफ्टी विद द मनी दो आई एम बींग फिजिकली और सेक्शुअली एब्यूज i am nobody uh, anybody tell me anything out of this but i need to survive by myself my dependency my independence 
and that is what lack failure is. I cannot escape from the situation, but I need to play the game of life. So I, uh, the the rubric is life is a game. They always play, okay, and play for security, safety, and money. And that is a theme of prostitute. So what is the prostitute feeling? Lot of abuse, dirtiness, self abuse, contempt, everything. But still, they make themselves very beautiful. They show world very beautiful. They give service to everything, and finally they earn the money with a good sum. So this is what lack phalanum is something. So they have a power, they have a strength, they have a pride, they have a ego, and everything. Are you getting me? Very easy to understand the situation. So patient needing this remedy of large military money. I could take control of conversation during the call, consultation. Sometimes it feels as though we homeopaths are following the patient rather than leading or guiding the case. So what are that? So extra developed senses, mostly larger predator as senses are very very good. Uh, patient needing this remedy are the very precocious. Answer the questions almost before you have asked them. They are very intelligent and understand easily. A uh, smaller predator is still predator and they impose thing, the overpowering in front of those who are smaller and weaker. But if they are confronted by something more powerful, then they submit. So in that we have one uh, uh, disposition that soft face superior and hard face inferior. Are you getting me? So what are the expressions of this? So the uh, one expression is powerful, power, game and strength. So why I say the delusion life is a game? Like Felino, because they want to play in a game. Okay. High self esteem, high ego, imposting others, overpowering others. So these are the dominated kind of. Try to be on the top. They are the leaders of the company. They are the leading competitive. So most of the females who are very self dependent in the company, in spite of so much so abuse and everything, and they are self dependent, you can think of like Felino. You know? Very, very important. We think of platina, but this is different kind of remedy. You know, aggressing, attacking, killing, hunting, chasing, devil, weaker, good with the, uh, devil with weaker and good with the stronger. So this is soft face, superior, and hard with Are you getting me? Okay, acute senses, visionaries, and clairvoyance. So these are the uh, few of the understanding of the predators. There are many mammals is that, but we end up with this. I will share you one of the case of uh, like Felina. Uh, the situation is something like a, a very deep sense. The lady has a complaint of uh, rheumatoid arthritis, RA positive, anti-CCP was negative. There is a pain, morning stiffness, weakness and everything. And <coughs> uh, having a headache, migraine. And the situation is something like that uh, the, the lady is uh, suffering from four years since and uh, rheumatoid arthritis is recently detected two three months back so in that case what i saw that there is a rheumatoid arthritis so rheumatoid arthritis is a conflict of two things rheumatoid arthritis according to gnm there is a conflict of two things one is a self devaluation because bones are involved and the second one is self separation so in rheumatoid arthritis, there are two conflicts associated. Separations, because it is associated with the periosteum inflammation. And the second one is self-depreciation or self-devaluation. So we need to find out both these things in the patients. How I need to find out? So I asked, tell me the life of yourself, what is happening in your life? So she started from the very uh, early stage that uh, she, uh, she had uh, two kids, one boy, one girl and living in a good family, husband is there, husband is working and uh, husband has office. So husband used to give not time, so husband is a boss somewhere. And uh, in hus under husband one boy is working, one boy is working under the, as a job. So most of time uh, what happened, husband is not giving time to that lady or child, okay. And husband is being very very uh, dominating, dictatorial and having uh, the need of sex only. So you go to that lady, have sex and he came to the office and everything but never take care of anything. And if anything she demanded, so uh, husband said that okay I will send that boy and you will go with that and 
take care of everything so that the basic need of that lady is love care and nurture now what happened the the boy was a very young uh, 17 18 years and that lady was something like 25 27 years so in 10 years of gap okay so and the kid was something little bit 2 to 3 or 5 years old two kids so in that situation what happened that boy went to that lady home जो भी काम था, जो भी काम करना था, जैसे कुछ लाना हो, मार्केट से कुछ लाना हो, जैसे कुछ शॉपिंग करने जाना हो, तो हर बार उसके साथ जाता था। ओके, सो ड्यूरिंग दैट फेज व्हाट एप्पन, दैट लेडी फील दैट दैट दिस इज दिस इज माय गुड कंपेनियन, सो ऑलवेज शी एकाउंटनाइ विथ दैट, एंड ड्यूरिंग दैट � so she is being always used by husband for the instrument of the sex. So she feels that this boy is giving me a care and nurture. So one day what happened? Uh, she had a relation with that boy. And she feels very relaxed and everything. So she gave her everything to that boy. And the story started from that. You know, now what happened? The situation is like that. That boy every day came to home. They both have uh, sexual things, and the life is going on. But somehow the society knows that something going wrong in the home. You know, see, everybody is the uh, what we call a spied upon. So they knows, and suddenly husband found that uh, this boy is uh, having some relationship with my wife and everything. So husband started accusing, abusing, and. Uh, physically hurting that ladies and everything, you have, this, you have done these things, you have done these things and everything. Uh, somehow the in-law comes into pictures, so in-law abuses her uh, like that you are the prostitutes, you can sleep with any boys, any girls, uh, we, we don't want to accept you, I need to throw it out, I mean everything to and the problem started from that. And from that what happened? The husband and wife got departed. Okay, so the process of divorce is going on. Now what happened? See, till that everything is okay, fine. Now what happened? The, that boy has left the job from the boss because of the situation. The boy is working independently somewhere else. Now that boy is something like a clingy to that lady. And that lady is also clingy to that boy. And what happened, the both got departed, not in, even though there is no divorce, but they live in relationship. And now what happened, the both kids are uh, growing, the both kids are uh, 17, 18 years of age, and they see that this is not fi my father, but this, is the, this boy is sleeping with my mother, always. So this is what, that lady is always uh, live with that boy. Why? Because their security is something like this. And the, she is giving everything to that boy. And she is being abused as a prostitute in society and everything is happening. In spite of that, she is living with that boy. And suddenly she feels that uh, I have done the wrong, I am very dirty, and this is the self devaluation started. And the separation from the husband, separation from the loved one, and it provoked rheumatoid arthritis. Out of these things, I had prescribed Lactalina, 30 single dose, and within three months, her rheumatoid arthritis went away. So this is what uh, my clinical experience of the understanding of lack remedy is uh, from the whole life situation. You can take ailment from abuse, you cannot find. It can be find the Lactalina, but you cannot understand what is the mammalian feeling is. So from that you have to understand the core of that. So mammal want group, pack, living with others, living with that society, in spite of being again for the sake of security. So this is what the understanding of lack group and lack remedy in short. Hope you enjoy this journey of understanding lack. Thank you so much and thank you all for hearing this wonderful sessions with me. Thank you all.